see an old one. And uh, try to get a spot for us on the other side of the residency. Yeah, I'll do that. George, put on your rain jacket, man. No, this one. The other one will keep you dry. That's going to no, keep. This is Yay, Georgie! See, what I did was I was scheduled to get on the highway on Saturday to come up to Sunbury. And this little girl was fighting for her life. second time like this has happened along our route because well, we had another little girl in Kingston that uh, the same thing so uh, I'm on schedule though like kilometers <laughs> so how many kilometers have you gone 987 by the time I leave here I'll have a thousand so, that's not bad yeah. for a day <laughs> <laughs> well today I walked 26 miles. Is that, is that the average? Uh, average? About 35. Yeah. Actually, he was off about 7 kilometers. Yeah, put it on me, right? <laughs> I'm going to be 
So was she a good walker, George, or Absolutely. what? Absolutely. We're making plans for uh, next year. Are you? <laughs> How's that? I'll just give you a laugh. How's that? <laughs> She's going to be a big part of the... Uh, Are you going to carry the torch uh, the for the 500-day Canada walk? Yeah, that sounds interesting. Yeah, eh? All that media, all those cameras, oh my oh, god. Oh, all that. <laughs> I don't know. Heidi Ransom, my wife. Director at the YMCA here, YMCA here in Sudbury. I'm a renal transplant uh, recipient. Um, I've been transplanted for eight years, and it's been wonderful for the eight years that I have been receiving my transplant. Uh, I'd like to get everybody to be aware of how important organ awareness and organ donation is important to give other people a chance and a quality of life. How do you think, uh, what do you think about uh, George's walk and is it necessary that he should be doing this? Um, for George's walk, the step-by-step -step program that he is doing for Ontario is an excellent program. It's getting everybody uh, to become aware of the importance of uh, organ donations, organ awareness. It's an excellent program. How do you feel about it, personally? I feel about personally, um, what he's doing is I have to give him 100% um, applause um, and give it, um, I, it's just, I, it's some things that I, I can't say in words what, how I feel, it's, it's so much, what he's doing is so much, I can't say anything more than that, it's so much. As a recipient, uh, does it make you feel good that another recipient can uh, accomplish what George is trying to accomplish? Because a lot of be people have a preconception that after having a transplant, you guys just stay ill. What do you think of that? Um, what George is doing and getting everybody aware that we can live a quality of life That's right. is, is, is fantastic. And you can live a normal life after receiving organ. You have a better quality of life from the previous one that you just had, that one you lost. And that is through your own experience, huh? Through my personal experience. Yeah. Of, of, from a uh, kidney a recipient. The energy that I have now um, is remarkable. And all I have to do is, is give the applause to the, uh, the person that um, signed your donor card and gave me that chance of having a quality of life. So I have to give the donor um, and the great applause for signing that card. Thank you, Heidi. Uh, the participants here that I teach at the YMCA at Sudbury. Yeah. Um, some of them are aware that I'm a transplant uh, recipient. Yeah. Some of them don't. Um, the ones that do not know, um, they think that they look at me and say that I'm a healthy uh, person who has a lot of energy, and then I give them the, uh, the, the rundown. Uh, view that I'm a transplant, and then they look at me, and then they see the accomplishment and. It's almost like they give me like a pat on the back and saying, good for you. And I, that it's makes you feel fantastic? I feel fantastic. Absolutely. I, I, I feel 100% better than I did before. Absolutely. So uh, being a fi fitness instructor, is, that's like strenuous, isn't it? You're volunteering here in the YMCA? Uh, How long yes. have you been doing that for? I've been an I've been instructor for about a year. Oh, yeah? Um, it's something that I, I want to give back. Mm. Um, to the community, mm -hmm. and this is the reason why that I'm volunteering here at the YMCA. I feel like I'm giving something back to the community for what they gave me That's in my life. Absolutely. Uh, I'll ask you a question. If, if it was possible to meet your donor or the family of your donor, would you be up for that? Would you like to do that and thank them, or...? Um, yes. It, 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 yes. In the beginning, um, no, I wouldn't be ready, but now the, um, the years now that I have been recipient,